Hey guys, today's video is all about my favorite leave-ins and cream stylers. So, if this is your first time here, I'm Farron. I do natural hair, skincare, and lifestyle videos. If you're returning or a subscriber, thank you so much. Be sure that you have subscribed and hit the notification bell just because it lets YouTube know that you enjoy my content. Okay, so in no particular order, we are going to start with the Suave Professionals with Castor Oil and Mango Butter Leave-In Conditioner and Style Butter. And for $5, why wouldn't it be a favorite? Like this worked really well on my hair, especially Especially because I used it for a wash and go and I didn't get any flakes like that was enough for me um I truly believe that if your hair is thinner than mine or like finer and you don't have as much and it's not as coarse you could get away with just using this as a style cream um it just I just need a little more for my hair but I really do like it it's not heavily fragranced. it actually is a really good product and I would highly recommend next I have in my leave-in conditioner from pattern I talk about this all the time just because it gives you moisture and it adds definition like you can tell a difference when I use this with other stylers like it adds just a little more definition that you might need might not be the best quality of products for the price but on definition alone I will continue to use it next I have the OMG curl cream this curl cream has the hold and definition seriously almost like a gel but it's moisturizing like this blew my mind I love my braid out results when I use this and just to like you could really get away with using this on its own. Like you could use a lighter leave-in conditioner and go in with this curl cream and I think the moisture and definition would last for days. I highly recommend this curl cream. Um, and especially on my type four hair, it just, it really gave the definition and hold that I really enjoy. Um, Olaplex number six, leave-in reparative styling cream, y'all this another product that blew my mind um a little bit goes a very long way I will probably I have other products but I would honestly say I will forever and always use this to blow my hair out just because it shortened the amount of time that it took to blow dry my hair and my hair felt so good it just felt incredibly smooth i would never use this product as a leave-in to like style my hair just because of the price um because you know 28 dollars for this little bit eh, not really but you don't need much of it like at all like i said before really great formulation and it just left my hair super soft and smooth going into a blowout next we have the four in one styler from unicurl i prefer this as a leave-in and maybe like a daily moisturizer just because it's a little lightweight um and just like the pattern leave-in conditioner it just adds a little more definition in my opinion i don't really know about a detangler or a curl cream for my hair once again if you have a looser curl pattern or not as coarse maybe i can't say but i like this as a leave-in a lot um the moisture lasts and lasts this is a product you can use throughout the year it's very lightweight and oh i love the scent like it just smells like summer it smells like a vacation so that's why this one made the current list this is future Farron. if i look a little different but i forgot to mention luscious leave-in conditioner it's a spray be sure to check out the video but that is a favorite for some reason i misplaced it so i don't have it here with me but i just used it but yeah definitely a fave smells delicious and it works okay back to the video the coconut mango hair butter from kinky tresses a forever staple like i just really enjoy it like i really don't have much to say about it i haven't really used it a lot this summer but if you saw my sienna naturals video i never really said what i used for that braid out but did you see it like their braid out was everything and 
my hair was so moisturized from that wash day that this actually gave my hair a little bit of hold and really sealed it in that braid out could have lasted for a whole two weeks and all i would have had to do was like rebraid it um but it, this the moisture and the hold for me is what really does it i just really 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 love this hair butter so speaking of the Sienna Naturals wash day, this leave-in conditioner, do magic, did magic. Applying this baby while you are in the shower really locks in the moisture. I don't know about definition, but moisture, yes. Like my hair was incredible afterwards. And yeah, I just really, really, really would recommend this leave-in conditioning cream. It, it's it's great and i feel like it might be like botanical oh no just kidding it's just really good though man i have mentioned something from this rose water collection from tgin in every video thus far i just it just really does something for me leave-in conditioner same as the other products super lightweight just really gives my hair the extra oomph that it might need like I can mix these products in with other products and they always seem to work well together. So this is just a lightweight leave-in conditioner I can really use for almost anything. <laughs> Ajoa Beauty Balment Leave-In Conditioning Styler. Again, like it has hold. Like you know when you are using this leave-in conditioner. Like when you try this with other products and you try to use something else like this is almost irreplaceable like this really had a hold on me earlier this summer when i was <laughs> starting my wash and goes i've kind of backed away from it you know because the connection is so strong between me and this leave-in but definitely love it definitely love the moisture the hold the scent it has peppermint oil um highly highly recommend this leave-in last but not least i have the coils in paradise charade sharia sweet almond oil leave-in conditioner y'all i've been using like the baggy method lately just to protect the ends of my hair because i really want to retain more length and this is just lightweight enough and it has sweet almond oil which my hair really appreciates that like i can apply this to my hair and uncover it the next day and not only does it have like a wonderful scent my hair it's moisturized and it still has hold like i use this on a wash and go and it didn't like disrupt my curl pattern at all and my ends felt super hydrated and it's so lightweight and fluffy like the consistency is amazing <clears throat> and the scent is just so refreshing that i have fallen back in love i didn't use this for a while but just the last couple of weeks adding this to my routine like i can definitely see like my hair especially the ends being moisturized that is all that i have in for my favorite leave-ins and cream stylers just because right now i'm not using a lot of these cream stylers to do braid outs and twist outs and whatnot i've really been in a wash and go mood that's really the only reason i would say i don't have too many right now but like i said i like to update these videos and do them every six months in the winter i would definitely probably have more cream stylers and things that i use so definitely come back tomorrow where i'll be talking about my favorite gels and custards and whatnot i'm excited about that one because i've been doing wash and goes i hope you guys have been enjoying these videos please give it a thumbs up if you are thanks so much for watching i do appreciate each and every one of you and i will see you in the next one